No, seven plus seven is 17. You're wrong, face it. You're not the world's smartest dog in the world. I'm sorry, you're not. You owe me $5. Oh, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Breed Review. I'm Liam Murphy, and today I'll be reviewing the Border Collie. So the Border Collie originates from Scotland. No, it does not wear a kilt. I don't know why, they don't. They can though, but do they? But don't they? They are considered the world's smartest breed. My boy's wicked and smart. They can learn a multitude of different things. They're very, very intelligent dogs. And they're also a very popular family companion. These guys are a medium sized dog. They get upwards of about maximum 40 pounds, so not typically a huge dog. Their coats are mostly black and white. That's primarily what you're gonna see. However, they do come in a slew of other colors such as tri-color and merle on blue or blue on merle. Or something close to that, but it's a long list. But 90% of the ones you're gonna see are gonna be like this. They do have a little bit of a longer coat and also they do have a shorter coat variety as well. Okay, so let's get into the review. Let's start off with health. Extremely healthy dog. These guys have a life expectancy of 10 to 17 years, which is very great. Not a ton of genetic issues that you have to worry about with this breed either. I mean, really just a very healthy reputation with these guys. I'm gonna give them an overall five stars for health. Okay, let's move on to temperament. Now, if you don't like activity, and you do like holes in your walls and in your furniture, this is the perfect dog for you. If you don't give these guys enough exercise, they will destroy your house. They will eat up your furniture, they'll tear up holes in your walls, they'll dig holes in your backyard, they will ruin your shoes. You name it, they'll destroy it. Even your soul. And your hopes and dreams as well. But if you are a really active person, then this is a great breed for you. Now, you don't have to be a sheep herder to own one of these dogs, but you do have to keep them extremely active. You do have to have a lot of things for them to do, because if you don't, they're gonna get very, very frustrated and they're going to act out. They make a great family dog. They're good with children. They're good with other animals. Again, that's assuming they get in the amount of exercise that they require. If you do all that, hey, you're gonna have a really well-behaved, obedient dog. Temperament for these guys, again, given the right amount of exercise, we're gonna go ahead and give them a five. Okay, let's move on to trainability. Like I said, they are the smartest of all domestic dogs. They are very, very intelligent. However, that being said, you really are gonna to need to work on these guys a lot in training. They require a ton of training. They need it. They have these very intelligent brains. They wanna be able to use them. If they're not used, they'll try to figure out stuff on their own, and you don't want that. As smart as they are, they're still dogs. Just because they're smart doesn't mean they're gonna do your taxes for you. You gotta give them something to do. I highly recommend you get them into agility training, fly ball, things like that. Look around your area for Border Collie groups. There definitely are some. And try to join up with those guys and maybe you might make some friends along the way too and so will the dog. And because a bored Border Collie, that is so hard to say. I, I'm, that is very, that was my fifth take. I gotta do it again now. A bored Border Collie can become destructive. So you wanna make sure that you provide enough for them to do, okay guys? Make sure you get them. If, you, if you're thinking about getting one of these dogs, really think about it. Do I have the time? Do I have the time to do all this stuff? Maybe you do, maybe you don't. If you definitely don't, don't get this breed, okay? Trainability, five. So the pros for the Border Collie are, they're a very obedient, fun-loving family dog. It's good with kids and other dogs. Overall for these guys, the Border Collie, I say, if you're active, go for it. If you're not, don't. So that's it, that's the Border Collie. Thank you guys so much again for watching. I really appreciate it. If you could, like, subscribe, comment, all those good things, I really would appreciate it. Thank you to everybody who have been watching these and who have been commenting and sharing the video. I really, truly appreciate it. Your support means the world to me. Thanks so much again, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Come on, AC.